The traffic pattern entry procedures ensure a safe and efficient arrival to the airport as you transition from en route airspace to the busier airport environment. First, determine the active runway. If the airport is non-towered and the active runway cannot be determined prior to arrival, fly over the airport at an altitude at least 500 feet above pattern altitude. Do not descend until well clear of the downwind leg. Establish the aircraft on a 45-degree ground track toward the midpoint of the downwind leg. If approaching from the opposite side of the traffic pattern, enter on a 45-degree ground track to the upwind leg or enter on the crosswind leg. Both pattern altitude and airspeed should be established approximately 2 miles from the pattern. Complete the before landing checklist and enter the downwind leg approximately one half to three quarters of a mile from the active runway. Pattern altitude is to be maintained unless traffic separation or ATC dictate otherwise. Once abeam the point of intended landing, apply carb heat if applicable, reduce power, set the flaps as appropriate within flap operating speed, and initiate a descent at the appropriate airspeed and altitude. Turn base leg at the proper position and altitude as traffic permits. Set the flaps as appropriate with coordinated pitch and power to maintain the desired approach airspeed and descent profile. Visually clear the area before turning on to final approach. Then, Commence your turn to final so as to roll out with the aircraft aligned with the extended center line of the runway. Set the flaps to the final setting with coordinated pitch and power to maintain the desired final approach airspeed and angle for the landing procedure.